really not according to the Adelaide University evaluation that went out and did extensive research in all of the communities except for Hinkler. They did go to Hinkler, but the results for Hinkler were not used or included by the government. And considering over 50 peak Aboriginal organisations were against this, right, it's only certain token elders that are saying it's worked when so many know it hasn't worked. Tell me why in Seduna and in East Kimberley so many Aboriginal people can't access the $200 every 28 days? Why are so many seeing money missing from their accounts but they can't get it back? They don't know where it's gone, right? Why are they denied food? Why has the card failed in the regions 840,000 times declined for food, petrol and rent. And that was when the card was affecting 13,000 people. So every time the card declined at a supermarket, for no reason whatsoever, it meant that a person has to leave that trolley of food and walk away and go without. And that happened 840,000 times, right? Oh, trading food... For pet, you know, and paying people's petrol to get cash. Create a lovely black market. Domestic violence is up, crime is up, and the small amount of people in the community that did have issues have not got the supports that they wanted or help. So Duna is still waiting for that rehab they've been asking for for 10 years, but their money never came. They never got the services. Okay, they never got that service. Who are these, uh, come on, t name these Aboriginal elders. Because the only ones I've seen squeaking, the only ones that have been left standing are Ian Trust in the East Kimberley, or on the wannabe Jacinta uh, Price in Alice Springs that wants it for all of her people while she's sitting on the Alice Springs Council at the moment and wants to run for a Senate seat in, in, as a Liberal, right? Meanwhile, her own her own mob won't have a bar of her and she lets the local elder live outside of town in a shed with no water. That's called respect, not. Okay? Hmm. Maybe you need to go read some submissions from the people that are against this card. Maybe you need to listen to the card holders that are suffering from this card. All right? You got no idea. Denying kids access to basics is disgusting 